Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we're getting back to work on our 1998 Toyota Tacoma Limited. This truck actually came with original fiberglass flares and because this truck was previously hit from the rear in an accident, this flare was actually pretty wrecked and all of them are kind of beat up. So in this video, we're gonna be doing a fiberglass flare repair on all of them. Let's go quickly take a look at some of that damage. All right, we got all the flares laid out here in the box. These two are the rear ones and they are the most damaged. As you can tell, they're all pretty beat up from rock chips, but this one right here is actually the worst because it is actually missing a chunk of the fiberglass as well as a massive crack here. Let's go quickly show you how much it's actually missing. Right down here is where it's missing a good two to three inches, which is annoying because that's actually hard to reconstruct. And of course the massive crack there, but those cracks are actually easier than having to make something from scratch. So dad, what are your thoughts on how we're gonna actually make that section? What I'm thinking is that we'd have to like make some kind of a, a mock-up here so we have something to fill our fiberglass up against, like foam or tape or... Something to make a backing, yeah. Yeah. It, it needs a backing in order to get the glass on it. And then we're gonna be doing it all on the truck so that the shape is uh, gonna match the truck. Right, right, yeah. So yeah, we're just basically gonna experiment, see how well it works, see if we can figure it out. So let's get straight to it. Right, guys this is the point we're at right now we just grinded back all the spots with the fiberglass and we tapered it out the thing with fiberglass it actually kind of shatters when it cracks so a small crack actually turns into a big hole when you grind it out so that's what we got going on there and we needed a bit of backing so we used tin tape but since they're big holes we're thinking it might actually dent it when you dab on the resin so we need a better sort of uh, backing on it right yeah this is the first time i've ever tried something like this we're thinking about maybe putting some body filler in behind the tin tape like you're saying if we we're putting the fiberglass on this is going to most likely collapse or push in right and then we'll lose our shape so if we put fiberglass or a body filler from the back and let that dry up then uh, we'll uh, have something solid to fiberglass onto we're going to do all those three and, yeah. and try it out and see if that works yeah because this one here is the big one where there's actually a piece missing. Yeah. And we're not too sure if that's gonna work that well. Completely experimental, see how well it works. And then with that knowledge, if it works or not, we'll see if we can do maybe the same for creating that little section there. Yeah, because in this one, we're gonna actually have to start with nothing. We have yeah. got nothing to work with. So. Exactly. We'll see how well that tin tape works in that body filler. Yeah, let's yeah. try that first. All right, let's try that. Turn back time and do it all again. You know that I would, you know that I would And if I could live it every night And do it all again You know that I would, you know I would You and I, you and I loved So softly like Soft, 
saucer of ice on the Sunday afternoon. Where did I, where did I lose someone like you? Gone too soon. And now I'm awake in the middle of the night, wishing I had a little more time. Thinking how all the years kept flying by, flying by. I'm awake in the middle of the night. I knew that everything would be alright. And if I knew what the end would feel like, it feels like. If I could ever turn back time and do it all again, you know that I would. You know that I would. And if I could live it every night and do it all again, you know that I would. You know I would. 'Cause I got no regrets, no regrets. Looking back, looking back. Time, and if there's nothing left for me, I would go every place I could. I would see every face I should, but I know that I find all the time isn't on my side. And now I'm awake in the middle of the night, wishing I had a little more time, thinking how all the years kept flying by, flying by. I'm awake in the middle of the night. If I could ever turn back time and do it all again, you know that I would. You know that I would. And if I could live it every night and do it all again, you know that I would. You know I would. 'Cause I got no regrets, no regrets. Looking back, looking back. Okay, quick update with how far we got. We finally got something figured out. This took a long time to just figure it out. We did a lot of experimenting with different ways of how to build this up. I think we got it pretty good now. It does look like we just taped it onto the truck, but the reason why we did that is we're actually gonna be glassing over that and then we're just gonna basically pry it off once it's done. I think it will be pretty good. We got a core here. These are basically called cores or like the backing for the fiberglass. Speaking of fiberglass, what we're using is some matte sheeted uh, fiberglass. We're just gonna cut up into chunks, put layers on with liquid resin glue, and yeah, we'll do that for each area. So let's get straight to fiberglassing. All right. 
right, guys, it's actually the next day and we let it dry overnight. So now my dad's gonna see if we can pop it off. Let's take a look at it. Hey guys, it actually came off in one piece. That is so awesome. The big piece that we made here is coming off. What do we gotta do now, Dad? I think let's pull off most of this tape here and then we'll start shaping and grinding the surface of this. And then when we're done that, we have to also pull all the uh, core material that we put in the back. Oh right? yeah, all the backings. And then yeah. probably the final body filler yeah. over top to get the good shape and all the lines. Cause there are a couple contour lines in there that we can easily get in with some body filler. But first let's grind off most of this fiberglass. guys we just finished sanding it all up my dad did an awesome job we got all the repairs done here and then the whole section we actually made right there big section there so now it's ready for the final body filler and then it's primer and paint and my dad's actually gonna be doing that at his auto body shop because he has a paint booth there because we don't have one here because we want to do a proper job when we paint these things to match the truck so he'll see you over there
right, guys, we're back home. My dad actually just finished painting them and it's the next day after letting them dry. This is the first test run to see how well they fit. These trucks actually come original with these fiberglass flares. Is it on all of them, you think? Like all, all these Tacomas have these flares? No, I think it's just the Limited. Just the Limited. Yeah, huh. that's yeah. as far as I could find out. Okay. All right, guys, we just installed these flares for good and it is looking so awesome. Believe it or not, this is the one that was missing a whole chunk and we completely repaired. This is the corner that was completely missing and it's looking awesome. You can hardly tell that it was even wrecked and damaged as well as the massive holes that were in there. It's looking super perfect, like from factory. Here's a quick clip from the front. Doesn't it just look so good, guys? From the front, you get to see both of them and these factory flares look so good, especially with the perfect color match and they're just them being so perfect looks awesome. This truck is still not complete yet. We still have a lot to do. This journey is not yet over. Subscribe, stay notified, and I'll see you guys then. See ya. Okay, mm -hmm. but what am I gonna say? Go away. Rolling.